Does anyone else feel like the stakes have really gone up since we found out Nate Bean is watching these? We are. We forever are. We are. Magic and magic and magic. Okay, so since uh, Kathleen has known me for the past mm, 14 years, I thought maybe I'd talk about some new stuff so that maybe she could learn something about me. So we got a new apartment and we're moving in the middle of April, but I realized that most of you have not been to my current apartment, so I thought I'd just show you a couple of my favorite things here. The tour of my, the apartment actually starts with the wall right behind me, the big green wall. It wasn't originally meant to be green, at least not this color green, and it's a rather large wall, so it's a rather large design statement, but it took so long and was such a pain to uh, paint that I decided I'd rather just leave it than paint it again. Okay, so from this perspective, you can really see how large the big green wall is, and it actually extends all the way down that hallway. So this is my first favorite thing about the apartment. Um, this is our bookshelf, where if you look closely, you can see I've arranged the books by color. So we have an orange section and a yellow section, green, blue, etc. I just like the way it looks and actually I can find my books more easily by color than I can when I um, organize them by genre and subgenre. Another one of my favorite things in this apartment is our bedroom wall, which is actually a forest. These are just vinyl decals that I stuck on the wall um, during an ice storm one Valentine's Day, and I really love the way it turned out. So that is the old apartment, and you guys are probably going to have to hear about the new one ad nauseum until we're all settled and everything. Um, I'm currently picking paint colors and figuring out how to arrange everything in the new space, and I can't wait for you all to see it. So something else that's also new um, is not so great. My lifestyle has changed quite a bit. Um, I had to withdraw from school this semester because of my health problems, and so I don't have a job, and I'm not going to school, and I'm basically laying around having mono for a really long time, and it's getting really tiring, and I'm definitely sick of both daytime and primetime television at this point. The only good thing about being at home is getting to spend so much time with the cats, which sounds really scarily pathetic, and I swear I am not a crazy cat lady. But come on, this is kind of adorable, right? I feel like the end of the video is confession time. And I definitely had to drink beer to be able to stare at a camera and talk to it. It's been a while and I feel a little ridiculous. So Kathleen, rest assured, I'm just as nerve-sighted as you are. I love you girls. I hope you have an awesome weekend. And Dinah, yay, I see your face tomorrow. So I almost forgot to, Kristen, tell you this. This is for short hair. You have to make two. One.